Alrighty. So next up tonight, we've got uh, McKinley James live. Uh, this is just such a fantastic listen. Um, it's uh, McKinley James is a is a newer artist, uh, and um, he he pretty much he plays uh, you know kind of like soul, kind of like uh, um, rhythm and blues, kind of like that kind of stuff. Um, and uh, he he's not he's not really well known uh, yet, um, but I he will be. I I just know it. Um, he is such a a talented uh, person, and um, you know he's got he's got two of the most talented guys playing with him. Uh, Austin John is on uh, the Hammond B three organ and vocals, um, and Jason Smay McKinley's father actually on drums and uh, McKinley on guitar and lead vocals. So and it's like I, it amazes me every time I hear this and I hear I've seen them live four times. Um, and it's just they put on such a great show. It's just. It's just nonstop. It's just nonstop good music the whole way through, and they don't get tired or wore out. It's just it's perfect the whole way through. Um, you know they they know their stuff, and you know I'm I um I'm kind of friends with me. I'm friends with McKinley. I, we message on Instagram, and like I said, I've seen him a few times. Um, and uh, I actually uh bought a guitar from him. I'm I'm not gonna get it out and show it because I have to get up and all that. But it is a uh I believe 2012 uh Fender Jazz Master and it is such a great guitar. I love it so much. Um you know thank you to him for that. It's just fantastic. Um and I you know I just love that and so he actually came to my house and you know uh I got the guitar and it's it's just so cool. Um, but, uh, the album was released May 20th, 2022, um, it's just fantastic, um, and, you know, I got it signed by the, the guys, um, let me show you the CD, the CD on this is just so, I love the art on this CD, look at that, isn't that cool, just the guitar, and it's just, I love that, so um all right into the into the track listing now uh it, there's 10 songs on here um his set is qu uh, quite you know quite a bit longer you know because it's a full set but uh the 10 songs from the set and it's just fantastic uh so it opens with clear skies since you've been gone which is one of uh mckinley's originals um just from the second you hear those those drum hits from from jason right at the beginning you know it's going to be a great album um and then McKinley and Austin kick in with the guitar and the organ. It's just, it's, it's such a big and amazing sound. Uh, and then McKinley kicks in with that amazing lead vocal. It's just, it's a classic, it, not, not, but it's a great song. It really, really is. Um, it's one of my favorites by him. Um, and, uh, you know, it's just, I love, I think I might like the live version better than the studio, to be honest. Um, but it's just, it's such a classic sound that they get. That's the word, that's the word I was going for, is that they get such a classic sound. And it's like, you think nowadays, you know, music is so overproduced and it's like, they keep it original and just keep it, you know, to like the basic three instruments. And like, they don't have, you know, they don't use any auto tune or any electronic drums or any of that kind of stupid stuff. It's just, it's three guys playing rock and roll. And that's it. You know, what, you know, when was the last time we really saw that? You know, it's just, it's, it's amazing. Um, this a great way to open the album. Um, so the next song is another McKinley original, which appeared on one of his EPs called By My Side in 2019. Um, it's called Love Can Make a Fool of You. Um, and this is, this is just a fantastic little song. Um, definitely a great, great song. And I love the version on here. It's uh, got a lot of power in it. Um, so number three is, uh, another, I believe it's an original. Let me, uh, let me, let me just check. Cause I'm, I'm almost positive that it's an original. It is. Yes. Um, and, uh, it's called Goodbye Baby. Um, again, I think I'm like the live version of this one better than the studio. It's just, it's so great. The organ is in there. just so powerful. Um, uh, McKinley's guitar and his vocal. It's just they put so much power into that performance. It's just great. Um, so the next one is called Cut You Loose, which uh, is not written by McKinley. It's a cover. 
Um, I love this song. I love this song so much. The way they do it is just so cool. Um, and it's like, I love that. It's just, it's so amazing. I just love it. It's, and they, uh, they did this live when I went and saw them the last time. It's just, I love how they do it. It's, it's so fun. Um, so the next one is another McKinley original, a new one that we got on this album. It's the first, the, this is where you get the, the song the first time. It's called Till It's Gone and it's a ballad. I really, really enjoy McKinley's ballads. He writes them really well and he sings them really well. Um, I love just the, the, uh, the sound of the band on this one is really, really nice. And, um, it's just great. And his vocal on it is so, uh, I don't know. I don't even know the word for it. Um, but he's, it's just a fantastic lead vocal from, uh, McKinley on this one. And, uh, it's just a great ballad. It's like, it's, it's, um, it's the only ballad on the album. So it's like, it, it kind of, you know, and they put it right in the middle too. It's perfect. Um, the sequencing on this album might be the best thing about it, just about, because they sequence these songs perfectly. Um, so next up is uh, another cover, Silly Daily Woman, which is probably my favorite song in the album. It's, uh, let's see, how long is this one? Six minutes and 39 seconds of just fantastic jamming from these three guys. Um just the vocal on it but then what what i really enjoy is the two solos the uh, the organ solo by austin and then um followed by the guitar solo by mckinley especially the ending of mckinley's guitar solo where they all go bam 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 and it's just they so much action and so much power that that song is it when you see if you ever see it live that's that silly dilly woman live by them it's amazing it's just so you just want to like just you know it's it's so great and i i mean i love the ver this that they put on here it's just because it's such a cool jam and it's so fun and it's like it's long but like it's so good that like it's it, it's it's long but like who cares it's just it's good you know um it's just fantastic i love that next up is another mckinley original called i can't live without you this is another one that was the first this is where you to get it the another new song on the album um till it both i can't live without you until it's gone both came out as singles before the album to kind of you know you know get it going and like you know promote it and stuff um i can't live without you they played that live uh i mean both time both of the most recent times i saw them but the the second uh uh you know t last time um i they hadn't put the album out yet and they hadn't put that single out yet and I just loved that song, and I so I messaged him, I was like, hey, uh, you know, what is this song, you know, is it an original, is it like a, you know, kind of a deep cover, and he was, uh, he said that it's an original, it might be come out as a single soon, and sure enough, it did, and I love that song, it's just so, it's, that's like, really just great straight ahead rock and roll, okay, that's two minutes, um, no, two, tw two minutes, 12 seconds, if you want to be exact, and it's just, it's so great. Um, Austin joins McKinley on the chorus. Uh, and it's just, it's so, so great. Um, McKinley's little guitar licks in there are just fantastic. And I, I love that. Um, next song is another cover, Highway 49. Um, the feel that they get on this song. I, I think that's really one of the greatest things about this song. is just, they get such a good, like, feel and, like, kind of thing going with it. And they just, they just, it's just so great. Um, and McKinley's uh really action powered vocals are just so fantastic in that um i just i just love that and again i saw that one live too it's fantastic and a live you know live seeing it there too so the next song is another mckinley original called spare change blues um this has been said that Mc, it's one of mckinley's favorite songs that he's ever done or possibly his favorite um and again i i just love this um he he does the uh, guitar intro, I think slightly different, I could be wrong, uh, on the live version than he does on the original studio version, um, but it's just, the version that they have on this is, is so cool, um, they have such a tight sound on it, and, uh, it's a really, it's, uh, this is one of the longer ones on the album, it's four minutes and 50 seconds, but, uh, it's just, I love this song so much, and again, his guitar licks in it, just fantastic, um, but yeah, just one of my favorites. Um, so the album closes with the song that they've closed their set with for a long time. Um, Marie Marie, which is a cover. Um, 
And as soon as you hear that opening guitar, those opening guitar chords from McKinley, it's just, it's so, it's just so, like, there, and it's just, like, it's so action, it's just, it's just great. Um, and then the power you get from the, from, uh, Jason and Austin on this, you know, behind McKinley, is just so great. And, um, I just love this song. I mean, I, I love, I've loved it from the first time I heard him do it. It's just, it's such a fantastic little rock and roll song, and uh, they do an amazing version of it. Um, so that closes it out. Closes it out, and uh, you know, it's just it's fantastic. Um, you know, ten out of ten. Highly recommend this album if you haven't heard it. It's on Spotify. Um, you know, it's just so if you if you have a spare thirty seven minutes and thirty nine seconds go listen to this album, because this album is amazing, and it's just, you just get so much with just those 10 songs, it's just, it's really amazing, let me show you this CD thing, this CD again, it's just, I love this so much, I love that, isn't it, just love that, so, uh, I think that's gonna conclude McKinley James Live, fantastic album, oh.